Hi everyone, we're going to show that our series is convergent and then find the number of terms needed to find the sum of the indicated accuracy. And this is our error here. All right, so let's look at this. I'm going to rewrite it uh, so we can get started. We're going to write the sum from n equals 1 to uh, infinity. I'm going to write negative 1 to the nth power times 1 divided by uh, n times 5 to the nth power. This, uh, according to our alternating series estimation theorem, this part is your b sub n. Now, that's the satisfy part 1 and part 2. So let's look and see that. If we have uh, 0 is less than or equal to, this is your b sub n. So what you're going to do is you're going to write 1 divide it by, and everywhere there's an n, we're going to substitute an n plus 1. And let's see if this is true. And then b sub n is just 1 divided by n to the times 5 to the nth power. Now this is uh, smaller than this number because the denominator is larger. So it satisfies 1. And let's look at the limit as n approaches uh, infinity of 1 divided by n uh, times 5 to the nth power. And that does equal 0 because of um, the denominator gets really large. This goes to 0. So it satisfies both of these. So now let's look at um, uh, this estimation uh, part. Uh, let's let b sub 4, let's see what happens with that. So if you substitute in 4, you're going to get 1 divided by 4 times 5 to the power of 4. And that's going to equal 0 0.0004. Okay, that is larger than 0 0.0001. Now, so let's look at B sub 5. That's going to be 1 divided by 5 times 5 to the fifth power, that equals 0 0.123464, which is less than 0 0.001. Therefore, by the alternating series estimation theorem, our n, the number of terms we need to find the um, accuracy, is uh, the number of terms is n equals 4. That's because the fifth term is less than the desired area and we need to add four terms to get to the sum to the desired accuracy. Since this is less than it doesn't get to our accuracy so we have to go to the fourth term. Thank you have a nice day. Bye-bye.